We all know that the FPS in Fortnite Chapter 5 hasn't been very good. So today, I'll be giving you guys the best window settings to increase FPS and lower input delay. Okay, so the first setting we're going to want to change is our game mode settings. And to go there, we're going to need to click the Windows button, then search Game mode then we want to open this then once it opens make sure game mode is turned on as it does optimize your pc and it will boost your fps and while we're here we can head over to game bar and what we want to do is make sure game bar is turned off as this does tank fps and your pc will focus on things that aren't benefiting your game so i really recommend turning this off after we finish we're going to want to head over to the windows search bar and we're going to want to search up graphic settings and then we're going to want to open it once it has been opened i want you guys to turn on hardware accelerated gpu as it does reduce latency and improve performance as it says right here and what we're going to want to do is make sure fortnite is on high performance and to do that we're going to want to click browse head over to the this pc section then click on the local disk that you have fortnite on then head over to program files then find epic games right here then click fortnite then click fortnite game then click binaries win64 then look for fortnite client dash win64 shipping.exe this one right here then we want to click on this then click add i've already added it but it should pop up here then once you've done that you want to click on fortnite options then put it to high performance which is your gpu right here then click save this will prioritize fortnite with your gpu and will boost fps in game now we can close this and we can head over to the windows search bar once again and search up power plan then we can click edit power plan right here then once we're here we're going to want to click power options you guys probably won't have this option but what we want to do is make sure ultimate performance is turned on and to get this it's pretty simple so to get the option for ultimate performance we're going to want to right click the windows button right here then we're going to want to go to the command prompt admin section click yes on the pop-up and what you guys are going to want to do is head over to the description where i have linked a command that you guys can copy and paste so i'll paste it right now and all you want to do after that is click enter and then you should have ultimate performance so what you do is you close everything right here then you type power then you click open then go to power options again and then you should have ultimate performance right here enable it then you can exit out the next thing we can change is to go to our taskbar and to do that we can click Control shift escape on your keyboard or another way to do that is to right click on your taskbar and you want to right click then click task manager and once we're here we're going to want to head over to the startup section and any app here that has the enabled sign right beside it means that it will start up once you turn on your pc and having these apps open can really decrease fps and your ping might be high so any apps here you don't use when you play you should turn off like this one right here i'll right click on it and click disable and then it won't start up when i turn on my pc and once you're done you can exit out so for our last optimization we're gonna do is close apps that we don't need and to do that we're gonna want to head over to the bottom right click the arrow right here then we're gonna have a bunch of apps that are opened on our pc and the apps that we don't use while we play fortnite we should close as it will tank our fps and it will make our game a bit more laggy so all these apps right here that you don't need we should close so apps like steam you should close as it will stop your game from performing to the fullest we can also close discord and after you guys have done all these optimizations your game should feel a lot more smoother and more playable and if you guys did enjoy this video i'd really appreciate if you guys liked and subscribe and i'll catch you guys in the next video